Hello everybody and welcome back to more of Pokemon Leaf Green. It's been a while since I've recorded this. I've been pretty preoccupied with Pokemon X and Y since they were released on the 12th. And boy oh boy, they did live up to all the hype that has been going on since January. Uh, I played a lot through Y. Uh, I pretty much did it in two days, 20 hours total for those two days. And uh, currently I'm playing X, I'm playing it as slow as I possibly can. I'm not at the second gym yet as of this recording, and um, I've been about three hours into the game. I've spent about three hours, I've been taking my sweet time, and uh, I'm enjoying X a lot more than I'm enjoying Y, only because I'm actually taking my time to explore every little thing that these developers put their heart and soul into, and these games are absolutely fantastic, but enough about pretty much the most anticipated Pokemon games ever, let's talk about the awesome remakes to the original games, Fire Red and Leaf Green. In this episode, we're going to be taking on the leader of the Pokemon Gym in Cinnabar Island, Blaine. And uh, he's a Fire-type Gym, so it's perfect to have a Water-type, and my Water-type, Poliwrath, is the perfect Pokemon for the job. So, let's get started! Yo, champ in the making! The hothead Blaine is a fire Pokemon pro. Douse his spirits with water. You better take some burn heals too. Ah, uh, the burn heal jokes. They are incoming. Anyway, this gym is all about quizzes. You can either challenge these trainers here to unlock these gates, or you can take a quiz. I'm gonna do both. I'm gonna take the quiz and then battle a trainer after that. If I get it wrong, I get it wrong. But either way, getting it right or wrong, I have to battle the trainer anyway, uh, for what I want to do. So, let's get started. Pokemon Quiz. Get it right and the door opens to the next room. Get it wrong and face a trainer. If you want to conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader, then get it right. Here we go. Caterpie evolves into Metapod. Indeed it does. You're absolutely correct. Go on through. Alright, let me adjust my mic really quickly, and let's face this trainer. I was a thief, but I went straight as a trainer. Alright, Burglar Quinn has three Pokemon, and out first is a Growlithe. Go Poliwrath! Growlithe's Intimidate's gonna lower our attack, but that's not gonna matter because we have special attacks. Go, Water Pulse! And there we go. So, down goes Growlithe, and up next for the Burglar is going to be a Vulpix. We will stay in. And once more, let's use a Water Pulse. And there we go. So the final Pokemon for the Burglar is going to be a Ninetales, the evolved form of Vulpix. And we will stay in. Alright, and let's use a Surf this time. Got Quick Attack, that doesn't matter. We only lost 9 HP. That is perfectly okay. That Surf was pretty close. Water Pulse definitely would have left it at about half health. Let's just finish it off with a Water Pulse now. Another Quick Attack only does 9 damage, and this Water Pulse is going to take out Ninetales, which means that is going to do it for this battle against Burglar Quinn. And we were really close to level 36. Alright, so now let's move on to this room, which does not have a quiz machine. So, we pretty much just gotta fight the trainer. Do you know how hot fire Pokemon can breed? How hot Pokemon fire breath can get? Next time I should read more carefully. Super Nerd Eric has three Pokemon. Out first is a Vulpix. Let's go, Poliwrath. Water Pulse. Critical hit, it wasn't needed, but it's always welcome. Down goes Vulpix, Poliwrath is going to grow to level 36 here. 
Excellent. Next up is going to be yet another Vulpix we will stay in. And once again, use Water Pulse. Oh wow, it actually survived that! Impressive! Good job there, Vulpix! But we're gonna take you out now with a Seismic Toss. And the final Pokémon for the Super Nerd is a Ninetales. We will stay in. And let's use a Seismic Toss first. Although Safeguard, now it's covered in a Veil. And this is automatically going to do 36 damage. There we go. And now let's finish it off with a Surf. Another 9 hit point loss on the Quick Attack. That's not going to matter. Still going strong is Poliwrath, and we even got a critical hit. Down goes Ninetales, and that is going to do it for this battle against Super Nerd Eric. Yo! Ha ha ha! Alright, and now we can move on here. Another quiz machine. As you see, that door is blocked, so let's take the Pokemon quiz. Get it right, and the door opens. Get it wrong, face a trainer. And this says it every time, so let's just get to the question. There are nine certified Pokemon League badges. Well, the Fighting Dojo doesn't count as an official gym in Saffron, so that would be no. And we are correct, we can go on through, but again, we're facing trainers as well. I've studied Pokemon thoroughly. You can't win! Super Nerd Avery has four Pokemon. Out first is a Ponyta. All right, let's use Water Pulse. And there we go. Thanks for coming, Ponyta. Next up is going to be wow, that was a lot of experience for a Ponyta. Next up is a Vulpix. We'll, we'll uh, we will stay in. We'll will stay in. Um, tongue twister. Um, let's use Water Pulse again. And there we go. And I believe that should give Poliwrath level 37. Lots of HP gaining on there. Next up is a Charmander. So we finally see a... I think this is the first time we've seen Charmander from a trainer. Uh, if not... No, I think we saw one in our... What was it? Rock Tunnel? Yeah, I think we saw one in Rock Tunnel. I think the only Pokemon we haven't seen from a trainer is Squirtle, maybe as far as non-rival people go. I don't really know, I can't remember. It's been a long time since I recorded those episodes. Anyway, a Growlithe is next. We will stay in. Lose some attack points with Intimidate, but we have pretty much water special moves, so let's just go with Water Pulse. And there we go. Thanks for coming, Growlithe. That is going to do it for this battle against Super Nerd Avery. Wah! My studies were insufficient! Alright, and now we can move on over here. I think that's another burglar. Let's take the Pokemon quiz. Alright, let's skip to the question. There we go. Poliwag evolves three times. This is a bit tricky. Uh, I don't remember what this question was in the original, it might have been the same, but uh, in the remakes, uh, since Poliwag now has the split evolution from Poliwhirl into either Poliwrath or Politoed from Gold, Silver, and Crystal, this question can be either or. Uh, we will say yes, though. Yeah, sorry, bad call. So they don't count it, count Politoed in this game. I like using Fire-type Pokémon! I just do. Although, the question can mean it evolves into three stages instead of the two being a split. I don't... Anyway, we got it wrong. Whatever. Let's just fight the trainer. Burglar Raymon has one Pokemon, and it is a Ponyta. Alright, let's use Water Pulse. 
take down. Oh boy, here it comes. Well, that didn't do too much damage. That's not bad. Pony Talk took a bit of recoil damage, and that should help us take... Oh, wow, no! Ponyta is a tough Pokemon when it's really high-leveled, and so is its evolved form, which Blaine will have, Rapidash. Another Water, pul water Pulse, though, is going to take Ponyta out, and that is going to do it for this battle against Burglar Ramon. Too hot to handle! All of that money. Glorious. Uh, really quickly before we face this trainer, I think he's the last one before Blaine, we will heal up our uh, Polyrath here with a full restore. I should have just used a super potion, but oh well. We have enough of full... Oh no, we only had two. We'll be able to buy more in a little bit, though, I think. Alright, let's take the quiz now. Yes, 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 we already know how the quiz works. Here we go. Our electric moves super effective against ground Pokemon. No, that is the other way around. All right. We can go on to... Oh, there is one more. Okay. But we're going to face this trainer first. I know why Blaine became a trainer. Are you going to tell me, or do I have to wait until after the battle? Super Nerd Derek has one Pokemon, and it is a Rapidash. So, we go from Ponyta from the Burglar to a Rapidash from the Super Nerd. Alright, let's use a Surf. Fire Spin is going to trap us in a Vortex of Fire, which is fine because it's not very. Fire, uh, fire type moves aren't very effective against water type moves at all. Um. That did a lot of damage to that Surf. That Surf on Ponyta, uh, Surf on Ponyta from the last battle probably would have taken it out. Uh, let's finish it up with a Seismic Toss. If you're attacked, six damage each time. Only two. All right, I'll take it. And this Seismic Toss is going to take out Rapidash, which means that is going to do it for this battle. We might gain a level here, actually. Yes, we do. Polyrath is now level 38. Excellent. And that is going to do it for this battle against Super Nerd Derek. Ow! Alright. And now, one more room remains. Oh, it's another burglar. Okay, I thought we faced our last one before, but I guess not. Alright, let's take the quiz once again for the final time. Pokemon of the same kind and level are not identical. That is true. Alright, we can go on through and face Blaine if we want to. I'll even go up. Oh, no. Oh, there is one. God, I can't remember these gyms at all anymore. Well, plus it doesn't help. I've been playing the new games, which does have a quiz in one of the gyms. I'm not going to spoil it in case nobody has the games yet. Uh, but there is a kind of a quiz thing in one of the gyms, which I absolutely love. Anyway, let's fight this trainer. I've been to many gyms, but this one best suits my style. Alright, Burglar Dusty has two Pokemon, and out first is a Vulpix. Alright, let's use a Water Pulse. There we go. Alright, and the last Pokemon for the Burglar is going to be a Growlithe. We will stay in. And once again, the Intimidate from the Growlithe does not matter because we have special type water moves. Go Water Pulse! And there we go, we have doused that Burning Spirit of the Growlithe. And that is going to do it for this battle against Burglar Dusty. Yowza! Too hot! Alright. Now, this is the final trainer before Blaine. At least I hope so, or else I'm going to look like an even bigger moron than I have already in this episode by trying to remember these puzzles. TM28 contains Tombstoney. No. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right. Let me check just to make sure I'm not an idiot. Yes, Blaine is the final. This is the final trainer before Blaine. 
Uh, we will heal up Polyrath after this battle before we fight Blaine. Fire is weak against H2O! Super Nerd Zack has two Pokémon. Out first is a Growlithe. Growlithe, when are you gonna learn? Special attacks, bro! Special attacks! Se thanks for coming. I'm sorry this it had to go down this way, but... Uh, Vulpix is the final Pokémon, so basically it's just reversed from fighting the Burglar. Alright, let's use a Water Pulse, and that should do it for Vulpix. There we go, critical hit. Probably wasn't necessary since we were a level higher than it, and water is super effective after all. Alright, and that is going to do it for this battle against Super Nerd Zack. Ow! Snuffed out! Alright. Now, Blaine. Quickly, let's heal up Polyrath. With a Super Potion this time, instead of wasting one of the full restores of only two that we had. Uh, do we have any ethers, or have I sold them all? I think I've sold them all. That's... oh, wait a minute, no. Yeah, no, yeah, it's not a split thing with medicine until the later games. Okay, so, let's save. Again, ignore the playtime, because training. 50 Pokémon in our Pokédex. It's actually pretty low for these games. Anyway, let's talk to Blaine. I didn't mean to press A so quickly there. Ha! Ah. I am Blaine, the Red Hot Leader of Cinnabar Gym! My fiery Pokémon are all rough and ready with intense heat! They incinerate all challengers! Ha! You better have Burn Heal! Alright, and here we go against Gym Leader Blaine, who has four Pokémon. And the first up is going to be a Growlithe. Let's go, Poliwrath! Once again, the Intimidate is not going to matter. We are just going to surf our way through this battle. There we go. Blaine's Pokémon are pretty high-leveled compared to Poliwrath, but we should be fine. Next up is going to be a Ponyta, and we will be staying in. Alright, and once again, let's use Surf. There we go! I don't remember if we got a critical against the Growlithe, but we got a critical here against Ponyta, which is very awesome, and that is going to make Polyrath grow to level 39. Yes! Next up is going to be the evolved form of Ponyta, Rapidash. We will be staying in. And let's use Surf once more. Oh, Rapidash has used Bounce. That is going to be very effective against us being part uh, fighting type. I almost said flying type. That's what the move is, not us. Oh, that Bounce did a lot, and it paralyzed us. Oh, no. We got off the Surf, though. That's good, at least. Bounce is a very cool move uh, that a lot of fire types can actually learn uh, that uh, can paralyze the person, which is very cool, although not really for us right now. Uh, Blaine's going to use a Hyper Potion. We're going to use a Water Pulse because I knew Blaine was going to be healing up his Rapidash. All right, and this Water Pulse, more than half. Excellent. Uh, we will use another one, although he's just sprung up again, because he's going to use Bounce once more. Uh, let's see here. I kind of don't want to use a, that full restore, because there is a chance that Bounce can paralyze us again. And I don't think I have any Paralyze Seals, so we're just going to go for the Water Pulse. Hopefully we'll be able to survive this. Yes, we do. Don't get paralyzed, Polyrath. Thank you! Oh, that was a smart play. And down goes Rapidash. One Pokemon already remains for Blaine. And that Pokemon is going to be an Arcanine, the evolved form of Growlithe. We will be staying in. And there's the Intimidate from Arcanine 
and we will go into our bag and use that final full restore to get Polyrath to full health and cure that paralysis. Arcanine uses Takedown, that's going to lower his health as well as lowering ours. Oh, here comes the Fire Blast. All of Blaine's Pokemon know this move. Let's see here. Good, Polyrath. That is very good. You took that hit very well. I'm actually surprised how well that Polyrath took that. Okay, there's a chance Blaine could heal up here, so I'm going to use Water Pulse. Alright, let's see. Don't take us out! Oh my god. And... Yes! This Water Pulse is going to hit. Blaine did not heal up, which, which is excellent. We got a critical hit to boot. And that is going to do it for this battle against Gym Leader Blaine. I have burned down to nothing. Not even ashes remain. You have earned the Volcano Badge. Ha! The Volcano Badge heightens the special stats of your Pokémon! Here, you can have this too! And we received TM38 from Blaine, and it contains Fire Blast. Fire Blast is the ultimate fire technique! Don't waste it on a water Pokémon! And that's a reference to the fact that Gyarados can learn fire-type attacks, including Flamethrower and Fire Blast. We have done it! Only one gym remains in the Pokemon League to conquer, and then we can actually take on the Elite Four and the Champion. Let's get on out of here. Huh? Hey, if it isn't James! Look, it's me, Bill! Long time no see! I hope you're still using my PC system! Well, listen, since we met up here, how about spending time with me? There's this little island in the far south called One Island. A friend invited me, so I'm on my way out there. How about it? Do you feel like coming with me? No. What? Are you too busy? Well, alright. The boat hasn't arrived yet anyway. I'll be waiting at the Pokemon Center over there. Come see me when you're done with the, your business here. And this is a portion that was not in the original game. Bill comes and talks to you after you defeated the Cinnabar Gym, and he wants to take you to a place called One Island. Next time on Pokemon Leaf Green, we will talk to Bill, who is sitting right at that table. We will accept his offer to go to One Island, and we'll see what we can do there. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.